Hello, my name is Omar. I am a transplant surgeon working for LifeSource, which is an organ procurement organization, also called an OPO. I have some important messages for you today, which you may not know about. The first thing that everybody needs to know is that OPOs do not have to do anything with declaration of death. The declaration of death in donors is an independent process which is regulated by hospitals and healthcare providers which are appointed by the hospitals. The second part of this message is what are the types of disease donation? There are two types of disease donation, brain, do brain death donation and donation by circulatory death. We need to understand both of them are different from each other. Brain death donation is a type of donation is in which essentially there is no brain ele electrical activity and it is irreversible. There is no blood flow to the brain. If you take such a patient or a donor off the ventilator, they would not be able to breathe independently. The second type of donors are called circulatory death donors or DCDs. DCD donors are essentially patients who are significantly ill and their families along with the healthcare team decide that they have very little chance of surviving. So when those patients are taken off life support and five minutes after their heart has stopped and they have been declared death, only at that time the OPOs come into play with the donation process. These are some important things which everybody needs to understand and that is how the disease donation pro process works in the US. Thank you.